New numbers this morning show just how much money is pouring into the Republican presidential pr primary. Candidates and their supporters have spent roughly $100 million on advertising throughout the end of August. Super PACs dominate that spending with the pro-Trump group MAGA spending more than $20 million on ads all by itself. Supreme Court Justice Clarence Thomas faces scrutiny as his financial disclosures are under investigation. As Kaplan's Leanne Avatar Bush reports, the statements include hospitality treatments, wealthy gifts, and much more. Supreme Court justices are facing scrutiny today over controversial financial disclosures. Clarence Thomas and Samuel Alito are under scrutiny regarding the gifts they received and the hospitality they enjoyed from wealthy friends. Two private jet trips in 2022 and a vacation at Adirondack State in 2014. These gifts were attributed to Republican mega donor Harlan Crow. Justice Thomas's legal team asserts that any past overlook of these gifts was entirely unintentional. However, these findings have really enraged the Supreme Court critics. How is it possible that we do not have a code of ethics uh, that is binding upon the highest court in the land? Harlan Crow, a billionaire real estate magnate, has acknowledged his friendship with Justice Thomas, which dates back to 1996. While both share a passion for Motown music, they claim to never discuss the cases. Earlier reports from ProPublica had already implicated Harlan Crow and three other prominent businessmen as ultra-wealthy benefactors of Justice Thomas. These reports revealed a staggering list of gifts, including at least 38 destination vacations, including an unreported yacht voyage around the Bahamas, 26 private jet flights, along with an additional eight by helicopter, a dozen VIP passes to professional and college sporting events, two stays at luxury resort in Florida and Jamaica, and one standing invitation to an uber-exclusive golf club. Has been living a life of extreme luxury for 30 years, underwritten by at least four different ultra-wealthy benefactors. In a five-page statement, a lawyer representing Justice Thomas referred to the allegations of impropriety as a partisan feeding frenzy and a political blood sport. They insisted that the justice had committed no willful ethics transgressions. Justice Thomas has received explanations for some of the disclosed gifts. He stated that one of the private jet flights was necessitated by an unexpected ice storm, while another was due to an increased security risk related to the court's actions regarding abortion rights. Thomas also mentioned being told that he did not have to report everything. I'm Leanne Abutar Bush reporting for Kaplan.